يسبح لله ما في السماوات وما في الأرض الملك القدوس العزيز الحكيم What's unique? Four names. And I want to mention the basic meanings of these four names in order for you to appreciate something about this, these ayat. Al-Malik means the king. Al-Quddus means the, the perfectly pure. Al-Aziz is the third one. Al-Aziz means the authority. Al-Hakim is the wise. Okay. The first ayah of Surah Al-Jumu'ah is about Allah. The second ayah of Surah Al-Jumu'ah is about Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. هُوَ الَّذِي بَعَثَ فِي الْأُمِّيِّينَ رَسُولًا مِّنْهُمْ يَتْلُوا عَلَيْهِمْ آيَاتِهِ وَيُزَكِّيهِمْ وَيُعَلِّمُهُمُ الْكِتَابِ وَالْحِكْمَةِ وَإِنْ كَانُوا مِنْ قَبْلُ لَفِي ضَلَالٍ مُّبِينَ The second ayah, I'll translate in a second, is about the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. One of my favorite ayat of the Qur'an, because in this ayah is a summary of the entire seerah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Now in this one ayah, Allah talks about the way that the Prophet ﷺ transformed society. And Allah mentions four steps. Hmm, where did we hear four before? How many names of Allah were mentioned? And Allah, the Messenger follows how many? Four steps. The first thing is, يَتْلُوا عَلَيْهِمْ آيَاتِهِ He reads on to the people the king's signs. How is a king known? By his signs. And the messenger tells the people his signs. Notice his kingdom. You see those mountains over there? That's part of his kingdom. You see that sun over there? That's part of his kingdom. That's how you know you're dealing with a king. He's known by his signs. Number two. The second thing the messenger does, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, the ayah says, him, And he purifies them. Purifies them. What was the second name of Allah? Source of all purity. You see a connection? The third thing, before I tell you about the third thing, Allah says He's the ultimate authority. You remember that? Where do laws come from? Laws come from an authority. Allah says, وَيُعَلِّمُهُمُ الْكِتَابِ He teaches them the book. And the word book in Arabic, kitab, is used in Arabic literature for law. So it's like saying He teaches them the law. And law can only be given by the proper authority. Al-Aziz is the only one who can make kitab. What was the last name of Allah that was mentioned in this sequence? Al-Malik, Al-Quddus, Al-Aziz, Al-Hakim, the wise. Allah says, وَيُعَلِّمُهُمُ الْكِتَابَ وَالْحِكْمَةِ He teaches them wisdom. Where does wisdom come from? It comes from the wise. Four names of Allah in one ayah. Four activities of the Messenger in the second ayah. And they're each correlated perfectly.